Hello everyone and welcome to the Horror Appraisal. My name is Sam, Sam Hodge and you are? John Vaughn. As you've noticed, Evan Hubbard is not with us today. He will be joining us and uh, John Vaughn is going to be joining us on the Horror Appraisal from now on in, in certain you know, certain ways. and Some videos yes, some videos helping film and, and this, but you probably saw before that I used to get a thing called a Horror Block. Uh, I quit getting that because it got really boring and just kind of old and tired and they started recycling products and all that good stuff. What do we have today? What is this called? Uh, fright Crate. Uh, loot Fright. This is like the Loot Crate Fright Edition. Yeah. Um, fright Crate's another one that you actually ordered me and that'll be coming. Uh -huh. That's why I got confused. We ordered a couple for each other. Um, so I got her a three month subscription to this and she's going to do an unboxing of this for the uh, January box or February box, whatever it is. Um, so it's the Loot Fright Sci Fright Crate. All right, so you can do the honors and open it up and do it blind so you don't uh, see what's going on. You have to turn it up on the cut the label there. And then one of the cool ways to do it is turn it around like this. Open it up. And then you pull out items so you can't see them. Keep it away from you so you can't look inside. Oh. <laughs> so you got a t-shirt first. What is it? Oh wow, it's a it's an alien t-shirt. Oh my gosh. That's really cool. Oh, that is actually really cool. Oh, I love it. Never seen one like that. It's a pretty good t-shirt. Yeah, it's really cool. I love it. Nice. What's next? Is that like a towel? Yeah, it's towel? a towel. The L the Lovecraft. H.P. Lovecraft's The Color of Space. I think that's that new Nicolas Cage movie. It's like a it's like a dish towel for your kitchen. It's pretty wild and it's trippy. It's pretty cool. It's like a lot of a lot of color. That's sure different. I'll definitely use it. The color of space. It's really colorful. <laughs> well, I didn't speak. Oh, uh, hey, that's that thing from uh, from outer space. That's that thing from uh, the X-Files. It's the X-Files. Oh, that's yeah. cool. I love X-Files. This is a, a, a book that wow. was featured in the X-Files, and I guess this is like kind of like a, oh, supposed to be like a prop. Well, I always was an X-Files fan. That's yeah. neat. It's a replica of a prop. Are you guys X-Files fans out there? This was a, a book that was featured in X-Files, and it looks to the side like it's a journal, actually. Like, that's like it's a... really cool. It's got blank yeah, it's paper. a journal. You can write things in it and keep it. That's, that's really neat. cool. That's kind of neat, yeah. If you're a fan of the X-Files, that's really neat. Yeah, I am. <laughs> What's your favorite episode of the X-Files? The Host. The Host? Uh-huh. Yeah. What do you like and about I the like Host? And I like Tombs also. Yeah, what do you like about The Host? The monster looks really creepy. Yeah, it's got a worm. And it looks really good the way they did all their monster makeup and details and everything with it is good. What do you got next? I think there's a pin in there. There should be something down in the bottom. Plan 9 from Outer Space. Oh, have you guys seen that movie, Plan 9 from Outer Space? It's like a... It's a pretty cool pin. It's really heavy and it's metal. It's a cool pin, but a really rough movie. <laughs> uh, I, I, I don't know what it is, but... Uh, it, I... it was named a long time ago. It's from like the 50s. It was named as the worst film of all time uh, back in the day. Of course, many films since then have passed that Even mark. Even though I but... don't know what it is, it's still neat. You, you, I guarantee you would recognize the woman in it because she's been on so much um, art and stuff. She kind of reminded me of... Uh, uh, it's kind of like that pre-Elvira look. Um, Gothic. Yeah. yeah. There's the, uh, I can, the oh, big premium on I can there. already tell. On the, oh, my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh. It says the fly wow. tiki muglet. That is so cool. 
when she is a coffee drinker, so this will this will definitely go to use. Oh, you ain't a kid, and I'm gonna use is it. Is it the pot? Yes. Um, that's cool. Oh my gosh. Well, I guess this is exclusive. Never to, seen that before. I guess it's exclusive to Loot Fright, so. Yeah, I've never seen this out in stores or anything. Oh my goodness. So what is the other? You've got wow. the you've got the Exorcist mug, mug right? Yes. The, the tiki mug. My son got me the Exorcist mug. Uh, but this one's exclusive to Luke Fright, so. This is really really cool. That is pretty awesome. They've I've never that. seen that before. Yeah. I'm definitely going to enjoy using that. Might be a little hard to drink out of. <laughs> well, the cool thing is it's designed to where you can hold, hold it, it like this and yeah. drink your coffee. You can put tomato soup in there and like drink a soup. Like, well, yeah. Like, <laughs> and then there's a little thing here you can hold on to to drink. Yeah. That's so cool. You need to put like a little uh, melted monkey in there that's kind of messed up where they, the, the chimp where they tried to like. <laughs> monkey brain. <laughs> that's so, this so neat. I love this a lot. So that is the Loot Fright. It's so cool. For, um, that is the loop right for, I guess, February. Uh -huh. uh, we're deep into February right now, but I know snow. This was sent off pretty early in February, but uh, snow across the U.S. has really put a damper on transportation. This was in California for like a week and a half. Uh -huh. It was just sitting there. It was supposed to be here like a week and a half ago. So. Um, but anyway, first first box impressions. What do you think about the loop fright? I really like it a lot. You think it was worth the, I think it's yes. like 30 bucks? Yeah. Uh, plus the shipping of like 12 yeah, bucks Yeah, because month. just alone for the shirt, that's something you normally don't see out. Yeah, that, that shirt would probably be 20, That would probably be bucks. $25. And then this that you've never seen before. Oh, yeah. That'd probably cost that much itself, too. Yeah. And then I like the this a lot because it, I like X-Files so much, and it'll be fun to use this as a journal. Yeah. The color of space thing is the only thing I'm not clear on because I haven't seen... The, that movie, but I know Nicolas Cage has been doing some really cool out there stuff recently, so maybe Could we should check it out. It's cool looking, too. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Well, guys, uh, we're sorry for being strangers for so long on the Horror Appraisal channel, but we will be around much more often. Uh, and Evan, look for Evan to join us as a three person duo kind of thing. Or not duo, trio. Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, what's your name? Jonah. I'm Sam. We'll see you later.